Good evening. It's been a week since a New Mexico woman says her father was killed in a carjacking gone wrong. Now she's asking the public to help her get justice for her dad. News 13's Jeannie Nguyen spoke with that woman and has the latest from police. Jeannie. Jackie, this past Father's Day was the first time this woman had to spend the holiday without her dad. She says it's still hard to believe the number one man in her life is no longer here. He was a man who had a heart of gold and he always made sure that people were okay around him. Destiny Diomedes says her dad, 59-year-old Jim Martinez, was a jolly man who put the needs of others before his own. He was just the easiest person to talk to and he would never judge nobody. But last week, her dad's life was unexpectedly cut short. That uh, was very hard for me to hear that uh, my dad was no longer here. Española police say Martinez was run over by a woman who stole his Jeep Grand Cherokee last week. Diomedes says her dad was just hanging out at the speedway. She believed he was in the wrong place at the wrong time. My heart is broken. After spending her first Father's Day without him, Diomedes says it's heartbreaking to know he won't be around for the most important moments in her life. I never actually got to tell my dad that I was pregnant again and um, was going to tell him on Father's Day. Officers found the Jeep at an abandoned home in Española earlier this week, and they have named 24-year-old Tamara Torres as a person of interest. They say Torres is not yet in custody, but they want to talk to her about the case. Diomedi pleads for anybody with information to come forward. We just want justice for my dad. He never deserved this. Martinez's daughter says he, wor says he worked for the state for 27 years and planned on retiring in December. Jackie, back to you. Okay, thanks, Jeannie. A memorial for Martinez is scheduled for Wednesday in Española.